All right, this is going to be my second unboxing ever. And as you can tell, yes, I do. Finally got a Windows phone. It is not the top of the line model, but it is a great model. As you know about Windows phone, it doesn't matter how fast or slow your phone is, you know, as long as it's within specs, you're going to get a great experience. So I'm about to test that theory out because I'm all about having the best experience and all that good stuff. Now, this was purchased at Walmart. As you can recognize the Walmart branding uh, stickers here. Well, it's not really branding, but it's their price stickers there or inventory stickers or whatever you call that. This is off the T-Mobile service. I did not get service with this phone. I basically bought it out the store, and it only cost me $99. It's on sale now. But the regular price is usually about $129. Okay? If you go to the T-Mobile store directly, you can probably get it for $99 off the shelf. And what's good about this phone is it works on the regular T-Mobile plan. It also works on the pay-as-you-go plan. So you don't have to uh, – you can do the pay-as-you-go, or you can do the unlimited text, web, and talk for $50 a month. No annual contract. I kind of like that. I don't have to worry about an annual contract, and it's almost like cricket. I can get unlimited. Oh, okay, little disclaimer. First, 500 megabytes up to 4G speeds. Okay. But hey, you know, but I didn't get it connected to use on a cell phone network. I wanted to make sure that I use it on a Wi-Fi network, and that's it. So this is going to be sort of my tablet. When you uh, flip the cover here, it's got that Velcro sticker thing here, and it shows you all the plans. It shows you the 4G coverage, as you can see here. And uh, it gives you all that data there. Now, this was um, something extra that didn't come with it, but I'll show you that later. Right on the top, oh, I can't get to it. Okay, let's see. How do I finagle this? To... Okay, I'm only using one hand here, so kind of bear with me. Usually when you open the top, it opens up to the phone right away. But this box here is a little bit different. Give me a second. Okay, I'm opening. Okay, as you can see, it's got these little things here. It doesn't really say where to open it. You just got to kind of tear it open. So let me go ahead and do that real quick. And to tell you the truth, I'm not sure if that's the best way to do it. Ah, okay. Tour the box up. Okay, it's not going to be the prettiest unboxing ever. I guess I could have one of those nice, you know, letter openers. Probably would have done a better cut there. Okay. I got the box open. And out comes my baby here. Let me get it out real quick. All right, there's my torn up box. And as you can see here, it gives you the information of everything that it can do, super sensitive touch screen, email, texting, and web compatibility. It's got a um, 5 megapixel camera, and it's capable of doing 4G, which is pretty good, as long as you stay within the 500 megabyte limit. And on the side, it's got the T-Mobile branding, which is nice. The bottom has all your information about, you know, the serial number and all that. You got your terms and conditions and how to activate your phone if I decide to activate this. I'm going to put that to the side for now so I can take a look at this beautiful baby here. This is the Nokia 521. Okay. And the reason why I always want to get a new phone because this phone that I'm using here has been my vlogging tool for a year and a half now. And the problem with that is it loses batteries too fast. Uh, I'll start recording, and then all of a sudden I'm just knocked out. I mean, I just I can't do anything else. So um, 
give me just a second here. I got to get a charger because I'm about to run out of batteries here. So hold on one second. Okay, I'm back. I'm just plugging in the charger now so I can continue using the phone to record my video. And I will be doing some sample videos. Um, it's overcast.